right angle is an angle of 90 degrees. If you consider the following triangle, this is called a right angle triangle because it contains an angle of 90 degrees. The most important side of a right angle triangle is the opposite to the right angle. That side is known as the hypotenuse. The other two sides, in this case B e and A, I often refer as the adjacent and opposite sides depending on the angle that you are considering. The most important theorem about right angle triangles is called Pythagoras theorem. Pythagoras theorem says that the length of the hypotenuse square is equal to the length of one of the sides square plus the length of the other side square. If you want to analyze what Pythagoras is actually saying, let's consider a right angle triangle. And now we are going to build three squares and each of them is going to have sides equal to each of the sides in the triangle. So let's consider this side here that according to the triangle before is called A. If we build the square that has sides A, we get something like this. Now, if we build the square that has side B, we get the following square. And then finally, if we take the hypotenuse, which is C, and we build the square that has side C, we get this. What Pythagoras is saying, if you think about areas, is that the area of this square is equal to the addition of these other two areas. Pythagoras theorem is going to be really handy when you are dealing with complex numbers and also when you are dealing with vectors.